Let's get into how tempo works. There are six total tracks represented in the middle of the plugin. These tracks are also represented as pads to the right. The tracks are color coded, but the order essentially goes from top to bottom and on the pads from left to right. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and one, two, three, four, five, six. The pads are for muting or activating tracks. You can mute or unmute individual drum sounds by clicking the corresponding pad on or off. Back to the center. Any drum samples are represented here. Here is where you can drag and drop any sample into the plugin to swap out and audition new sounds. With the individual pattern selector, you can change the pattern that is currently playing the corresponding drum sound. This is handy for finding new and interesting patterns. Here you have the export to MIDI button. This will export the current MIDI file to anywhere you choose on your computer. Creating a dedicated folder for MIDI exports is recommended. The color bars here adjust the volume for each sample. Here you have a simple representation of the current selected pattern. You can drag and drop any MIDI file onto this window to play it inside of Tempo. Click on Edit Sample to edit and add effects to any sample using the knobs to the left. Here on the left are the editing controls, a low and high pass filter, a gate, a limiter, saturation and attack release. To turn on the limiter, simply click this button next to the gain knob. You can control the input gain here, then control the peak with the limit slider. Tempo can be used in pattern mode or in one-shot mode. You can change that here. Notice how the switch is actually a button. You simply click the mode you want. In pattern mode, any key can be pressed and held to play the drum pattern until you release the key. In one-shot mode, you can play individual drum sounds and use tempo as a drum sound source. Here you have the browser, where you can browse full drum patterns and one-shot drum sounds. Click the search icon to open and close the browser. You have genre-specific categories so that you can quickly dial in on the type of drum pattern you need. Selecting a pattern will bring up a full drum pattern along with the associated drum samples. You can press any key on your MIDI keyboard to preview the pattern and record the pattern into your track.